Hey everyone, today we are going to solve the little question container with most water. Okay, so let me explain with this example. So for this question, we just calculate the max length of rectangle, right? So formula of rectangle is width multiply height. So each number is height. So it's easy to get the height, right? So how about the uh, width? How can we calculate the width? So width is just distance between two numbers. So it's a good idea to have uh, two pointers. So one is a left pointer starting from index zero, and uh, the other is right pointer start from the last index. So uh, let's see how it works. So first of all, uh, so distance is so 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So 8. So 8 minus 0, right? So that is 8. And how about the height? So we have to take a, a smaller height so because uh, if we calculate based on total height, the water would uh, overflow from the container, right? So that's why uh, we compare 1 versus 7. So take uh, 1, right? So 8 multiply 1. So max area should be 8. So this is our first calculation. So current max area is 8. And uh, next, we have to move one of pointers. So how can we judge? Um, so it's simple. Uh, we want to keep um, total height because uh, there is a possibility that uh, we can get max, max area uh, later calculation. So in that case, uh, compare uh, 1 versus 7. And uh, 7 is uh, uh, taller than 1. So that's why we move left pointer to next. And uh, OK, so next calculation should be, so actually we do the same thing. So 8 minus index 1 is 7, right? And uh, how about height? 8 versus 7. So we take a smaller uh, height, 7, right? So 7 multiplied by 7 and 49. So compare 8 versus 49. So we should keep 49, right? So uh, current max area is 49. And uh, we have to move one of uh, pointers, 8 versus 7. And uh, we want to keep uh, total height, so 8. So that's why in this case, we move right pointer to next. And then uh, again, so this is uh, index 7, this is index 1. So 7 minus 1 is 6 multiply. So height should be a smaller height. So 8 versus 3. So in this case, uh, 3, right? So eight, uh, 6 multiply 3. So that is 18. And I compare 49 versus 18. So max area is still 49, right? And then after that, um, we have to move one of pointers. So we keep a, a, high, a total height, 8. So that's why move right pointer to next. And then um, again, uh, in this case, index 6, 6 minus 1 is 5 multiply, so 8 and 8. So we take a 1 of height, so that is 40. So 90, 49 passes 40, so still 49 is a max area. And then after that, so we can move one of um, pointers because they're 8 and 8, right? So in that case, uh, okay, so let's move left pointer to next. And uh, now index two, and the right is index six. So uh, width is four, multiply. So we take a smaller height, six. Six is 24, and the 24 versus 49. So 49 is still max area. And then uh, move uh, one of pointers and keep uh, total height, eight. So we move left pointer to next. And now index 3, so 6 minus 3 is 3. Multiply, um, take a smaller height, and 2. So 2 equals 6. And then compare 49 versus 6. So still 49 is a max area. And then I move one of pointers and keep a, a total height. So that's why move left pointer to next. So index 4. And 6 minus 4 is uh, 2, multiply, take a smaller height, uh, 5, 5 equal 10. And then still 49 is a max area. And uh, move uh, left pointer to next, so now index 5. So 
uh, width is one, multiply uh, four, right? And then uh, equal four. So 49 passes four. So we keep a 49, right? And then uh, move uh, left pointer to next. So now uh, right pointer and left pointer is the uh, same index. So we finish iteration. All we have to do is uh, return 49 in this case. Yeah, so that is a basic idea to solve this question. So let's jump into the code. Okay, so let's write the code. First of all, create a max area equal zero. And uh, left pointer start from index zero and the right pointer start from the last index. So length of height uh, minus one. And then start iteration. While left is less than right, we continue. And the calculator max area, so max area equal, so max and the current max versus, so width should be right minus left, right? And the height should be a smaller height, so that's why mean and the left height versus right height. And then after that, we have to move one of uh, pointers. So if um, height and left is uh, less than height uh, right. So in that case, uh, we so we want to keep uh, taller height, right? So that's why in this case, uh, we should move left pointer to next. If not the case, um, so we move right pointer to next. So right minus equal one, because a uh, right pointer start from the last index, right? So if we move to next, we should add minus one to right pointer. So uh, we use uh, like uh, just less than, um, but uh, I think uh, less than or equal also works because uh, if uh, left height and right height are same, so we can move uh, one of one of them. So that's why uh, it will work. But uh, we keep uh, like uh, just less than. And then uh, after that, uh, just return uh, max area. Yeah. So let me submit it. Yeah, looks good. And the time complexity of this solution should be order of n, where n is the number of elements in the input array. And the space complexity is, I think, O1. We don't use the extra data structure, right? Just simple variables. Yeah, so that's all I have for you today. So please support me with your actions, such as comment and hitting the like button. I'll see you in the next question.